All right, so this next one I'm gonna go over is I would say the hardest circle problem I've seen on any of the SAT practice exams. So if you can get this, I, I'd say I'm pretty confident you can get any circle question. So the perimeter of an equilateral triangle is 852 centimeters. The three vertices lie on the circle, so they're on the edge. And then the radius is W square root of three. We gotta find W. So basically what's going on here is we have this circle. I'm gonna draw it and with the center. And we have a equilateral triangle that lies on the edge of the circle. So it looks something like this. Um, the perimeter is 852. We need to divide that by three. So I'm gonna put that in my calculator. That means each side is gonna be 284. So let me write that in. And then now we need to find W. So um, W square root of three is the radius. The radius is basically um, the center to the edge of the circle. So I'm gonna draw these two to form like a little triangle here. And then this is gonna be W square root of three in here. And then basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna form a right triangle and then we're gonna use that to get our answer. So this looks really bad, so I'm gonna draw this down here. So we have this right triangle, let me draw it out. We have w square root of three here, and then we have 284 divided by two, because we split that little triangle we made in half. So 284 divided by two, that's gonna be 142. And then this angle right here Remember, equilateral triangles have angles of 60. We're kind of splitting that angle in half, so this is gonna be 30. And then now, if you notice, it's a right triangle. We know the angle, we know one of the sides. That's all we need. We can just trig it out from here. So basically, we wanna find the hypotenuse, and then we're gonna set that equal to uh, w square root of three. So I'm gonna set w square root of three equal to x. Um, just uh, bear with me here. I'm going to explain why where x is the hypotenuse and then we're going to set them equal at the end. So what we'll do is we'll do, um, let me go over here. We'll do cosine 30 because we have the adjacent side equals adjacent over hypotenuse. So 142 over x. Cosine 30, if you know your unit circle, that'll be square root of 3 over 2 equals 142 over x. So then if we solve for x, let's multiply it to the other side. We'll get square root of three over two x equals 142. Now let's just divide it out to the other side. So then x is gonna equal 142 times two over root three, which is just gonna equal, um, that'll be 142 times two. It's gonna be 284 over root three. So then now, all we have to do now, um, x is the same as w square root of three, so we just set w square root of three equal to 284 over root three, and then we solve for x. So let's multiply that root three out to the other side. That'll give us three w, because square root of three times square root of three is just three, equals 284, and then we divide by three on both sides. So w is gonna be equal to 284, over three, and you can enter your answer just like that. If you need more SAT help, go check out mvplearners.com. We offer SAT tutoring for only $40 a lesson. It's a great deal. Go hop on it, go to the website and fill out the form. Hit book a call now. I look forward to seeing you guys.